Okachuku Okaroha. Safety from Marshall. Good. Good. Come on. Three. There we go. Good. Good. There we go. Up. Four. There we go. Come on. Keep pushing. You ready for you ready for just keep it simple. First one. Five. Just to hop up. Good. Go. Good job. Good job. Get him over. Good. 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 Ah, there, ah, there you go. Good. Hand knock coordination. Hand knock. Get that head on the swivel. Oh, there we go. There we He's a really good trainer. You know, I've just been training with Toby for like for about a year now, and um, so I just feel so much like better, like fit, more fit. I feel myself being more solid as as a player, you know, and just moving good. So like, I like Toby. It's a he's a real good guy also. So and like you just come to him for anything really. You can talk to him, and, and like you know, he's just a it's a great person overall. Appreciate you. Job, fellas. Hey, listen, pain is in the mind. It's temporary. Tempor you got to make sure that, you know what I'm saying, when you're going through these drills, you're going to get tired. You got to make sure you keep that technique. By like keeping that technique. Huh? Well, uh, he motivated me, like, especially, like, with, with the other guys that I, I looked up to, you know, uh, as a, when I was in high school, you know, Derek Williams and the Bowman Bowman's and stuff. So I just, you know, guys that I, I looked up to, you know, watched, like, you know, played at the same level I was and just took it on to the next level. And, you know, and uh, it was just, that's, and just being around those guys, you know, just seeing how, seeing how they're working, just makes me want to work also as hard. So, and uh, Toby, he just, Toby always is just that, that ear, that voice in you that is just, you know, to push you and just keep going. Like, you know, when, especially when you hurt and just keep going, just work on your tired. It's a dream. It's always been a dream of mine, just to hit, just to see your name just go across that ticket, you know. But I feel like either way, either way, just to play in the NFL period is a dream of mine. You know, uh, drafted or undrafted, you know. And I just, I'm just ready to just take it on to the next level. So I know as soon as I get into any camp, I'm gonna do everything I gotta do to make the team. Come on, there you go. Come on. Let's go. The fact that the fact that I always feel like I feel like I'm I'm always coming in as an underdog, you know, I'm always coming in under the radar, just like in this situation. I feel like I'm better than a lot of safeties around the country. But I feel like I'm better than a lot of safeties around the country, but you know, just things happening the way it did at Boston College and everything that happened just you know, just has me in the position that I am right now and I wouldn't trade it for anything, but you know, I just just coming in as that underdog always keeps my keeps that fire in me just burning, just just knowing that I'm better than that. There's a lot of people that I just need to show it, show the world about it. And just you know, really all it is just one team to fall in love with you. So that's my goal. Good. Here we go. Good, good, good. Ah, good job, boy. That's it, right there. Last one. That's it, right there. Who's your uh, favorite NFL athlete? Sean Taylor. Sean Taylor. Uh, my room is full of Sean Taylor pictures from college. I wanted the NFL. You know, like his towel when when they just when they when he first passed. It was yeah, it's Sean Taylor. But since since he's been since he passed, uh, I have to say every.
your family to see to hear your name get called in the draft or if not the draft just to see your name on a roster and i felt roster talk about what that would mean to you your family your area your city mm, it's it'll be amazing like i mean i know for my family my mother my mother always tells me how you know how proud she is she's happy of just where i am now just being able to graduate college and you know just looking for something to do as far as me i just want to play football and you know just you know, just seeing, just being on the NFL roster is, it would be big to my family because it's something that they they always seen me just work towards since I was young. So just finally just being there, finally just getting getting what you've been working for for so many years, just it'll be a blessing for me and my family. And just this area, you know, just it's the same thing with them. Like this area didn't see me when I was in when I was at Roosevelt working at Roosevelt. Just having to just you know when nobody really knows how far you'll take it, and you know just and just being on the roster, this area I feel like I feel like it's, it'll be a really good prize for you know uh, a lot of people. It'll be it'll motivate a lot of other people, a lot of young people also to just you know just, it's not as hard as it seems. Just keep working and stay focused. All around football player, uh, tackle, you can cover. You can do it all, really. Okay? Ain't nothing, I, ain't nothing on, ain't nothing on the field out there that you telling me go out there and do it. I can't do it. So, just really, just an all around football. And how would you want people to remember you off the field? It's a humble, a very humble, just great person, really. I just, you know, just like to work hard. You know, and, um, I just try to stay low to the ground. And uh, just humble and just work, just hard work.